I've been called everything, so for good and bad. <laughs> I'm an industrial designer, so, um, and in the last, let's say, you know, 25, 30 years of practicing, I concluded that if I really want people to love design and be passionate about it and understand how it can elevate their lives, their daily lives, I need to reach a, a larger audience. That's where my mind is at. I, always, I have this kind of radar where I keep thinking about something, thinking about something, and Basically, I'm trying to send the energy out there for, so somebody will call me. <laughs> and then a hotel company uh, contacts me, uh, Marco and Mateus, and they asked me about doing a kind of budget hotel. And I was thrilled because I always wanted to do that kind of project. I had stayed at a lot of those kind of hotels, two star, three star, one star. And when I looked at them and I was in their spaces, I always thought that for the same amount of construction of money, same amount of energy, same amount of time and people, the hotel could be so much better designed and actually really designed, not just decorated. You know, the beautiful thing about, I'm fortunate, of the profession of industrial design is that it's extremely broad because it's about touching everything in our physical environment. So it's, and it, it engages all industries. So as a, you know, as a designer, you could be designing dishes, porcelain, um, cups and saucers, flatware, uh, tables, but then at the same time, you could be designing the camera that, uh, that I'm being filmed on too. I want to make some products that these people would be using every day. And I think that gave me the kind of title of populist designer. Hanover is kind of an unusual building. I didn't do the building, um, but the, the building itself is a very different presentation. But I'm trying to perpetually shift it, change it, build some sort of relationship with the place, with the city it's in and also to try and experiment to push other boundaries in it, to give a different sense or different feeling. Uh, very critical, you know, which I, I, I think it makes me a good designer, B, it makes me a terrible person, <laughs> because, because I want everything perfect. I want to change the world.